Okay, here we have the Hexbug Nano Bridge Battle Set. I've assembled all the pieces from the box uh, in one of the stock setups as shown on the front of the box. I'm going to just quickly talk through what you get in each box. You get four of these white hex cells. Each hex cell has a orange door on each of the facings, that opens and closes. There are 16 legs, and the legs are quite clever. I'm going to just bring another one into uh, the foreground so I can show you. So the legs have got a small stumpy peg on the upper part of one length of the leg itself and that means it doesn't slide all the way through the slots that are again on each facing you get it wrong and it will slide through now you might want to do that for other multi-height level uh, habitat sets but in this case you want them on legs because you're raising the battle arena which is the main part of this so four hex cell arenas each with six doors. I've got the door going into the battle arena open on each end. Six legs on each hex cell, although four would probably do. You don't need to have six, but I've done six because that's uh, that's probably the best, most stable configuration. You also get four of these curve joints, and three of them would make a full circle. So it's a third of 360. You've got 120 degree uh, bend and you also get two straight lengths that are uh, uh, in each side of this so you've got yourself uh, two hexes underneath two hexes above and you've got basically the battery on top so you also get included within this a black and a white rare mutant bug I'm going to kick them off one on each end and let's see what happens so the idea is the bugs will battle in the arena. I'm going to introduce some additional bugs because that's partly what the, uh, this is all about. Just two alone is not going to really show you a great deal more than who's the champion. Okay, as you can see the black bug's already gone in. I was going to prod the white one to go in as well, which I probably will do now just so you get to see what goes on. And you see them going through a flap. So the actual battle arena has got two one-way doors that enter the bug, allow the bug to enter sorry, into the arena but doesn't allow it to exit. You saw that bug that was falling over self-right. Now the arena is obviously an area where bugs are gonna possibly fall off themselves, but the idea is that they're battling, pushing and nudging each other, and only the victor will survive. And at the end of the day, as I'm introducing additional bugs that don't come with the set, just to give you an idea of what goes on. Particularly noisy bug, I'm just gonna get him out. At the moment, the black bug is the uh, overall champ, and the other guys are on the lower decks, waiting for the next rematch. And as you can see, um, although this is a simple configuration, you need to add a few more bits to this to allow you to get the bugs to actually drive themselves up the level. Now there are already some sets that allow with some special spirals, a little bit like this, but they're actually orange and angled uh, in such a way where bugs can drive out of one of the cells and up a level so that they are able to then link in and you get a more continuous type multi-level arrangement now at the moment i'm going to open this door at the moment we've got uh, yellow being the victor he's actually pushed the black one out but there's still another contender which i'm going to just for expedience sake of the video push in to get them to actually face the yellow and let's just have a look at this let's see what happens um the battle arena piece itself was my favorite it's able to stay suspended in midair because it's actually got hooks on either end, so it can absolutely fit flat on the ground. It doesn't have to be suspended. Works equally well, and there we are. We have the victor. Although it was late to the game, um, the petrol-coloured, purpley, sea green one is the victor. I'm going to give the black nano just one more chance because he was doing so well against the other guys. I don't think these two actually uh, had chance to fight each other, and um, I'll declare the uh, the final winner in this second heat heat off. Okay, so a couple of bugs are actually falling out downstairs as they're charging around, uh, generally nudging and waiting for the next race. And I just want to add that <clears throat> the one-way doors are actually removable. Now, it's a little bit difficult whilst they're fighting, but I'm going to just quickly show you. If you're very careful and you prize the quite flexible orange plastic, what I've done there is I've actually taken just one of the doors off. So you can do that so you can actually have an option for the bugs to go through the arena and come out. You can also roll the door around so that actually the bugs are only able to exit and not enter. Not sure why you want to do that so much, but it's just uh, wanted to give you the full options that these doors give 
the uh, arena. Quite flexible, quite well designed. It's a sturdy unit, it's a good soft plastic, it's nowhere near as brittle as the uh, the white ones uh, sometimes feel to be. And as you can see, I'm going to declare the final winner, just as the purple bug runs off the table, the black nano bug.